We're not messing around today. Let's just go straight to the charity shop before we do anything. Oh my God. Oh, I thought I was so dead then. Afternoon. Sorry, I'm gonna get no notes, mate. I thought I saw a spot. Sealed. No. Oh, could he? No. Industry supply. Jack Pike. Turner. Still there. Got a nice little stack in today. I only really want a couple, do you know what I mean? Oh, very snazzy. <laughs> <laughs> I guess the treatment that puts me inside doesn't match. <laughs> Don't be daft. You're the one that makes the jacket. Yeah. I'm gonna buy that, I think. There's quite a few there, but I know Lego ones can be alright, but a freak with a pop. I've got the best, I think. Good afternoon. Oh, you're munching, aren't you? That's right. You've got some gaming stuff out there, other bits. I've noticed there's obviously quite a few bits staggered around. Have you got any more coming out? Was that it? No, that's it, Ricky. You, yeah, you must have had a big chunk come in. Yeah, a guy dropped off an Xbox, Xbox One. Yeah, I've seen that, yeah, yeah. And, and a Wii the Wii stuff. one. The only part of the other Wii that we've got is they've got the balance board, but it needs battery testing. Crap, anyway. Yeah, yeah. That's all it at the moment. No worries, what I ask. Enjoy your dinner. Yeah, Lunch, you. probably breakfast, actually, knowing you. Yeah. <laughs> These are nice, aren't they? Yeah. Tupperwares, coffee. Is that sugar? I don't know, what is that one? <laughs> Tea, <laughs> coffee. <laughs> Sugar, maybe? Take a picture of that. I think we'll buy it. Yeah. Have you been menaced? Cool, but... I think that's going to be my lot, mate. We'll just load it into that bag, eh? That's what we'll do. When you're building up your credit, are you? Just pulled up from the charity shop. You all right up there, girl? Hmm? Next door's cat loves our house. Pretty decent, huh? I like that. Oh, I can't, actually can't move in here at all. Can't move for cardboard. In fact, let me just show you why. All right, guys, just getting my new car delivered. Yeah, be here soon. <laughs> just getting my new car delivered, ignore him. This is always on about. Yeah, I've been working hard for this. It starts first time every time. <laughs> Leanne has blessed me with a ton of cardboard boxes and so foam and so stuff. I'll oh, bless you. That's to say thank you, Lars. I'm also just getting my new car delivered, so um, <laughs> keep an eye out for that one. You can get loads in that, Ricky. I get tons here. Yeah. No, this is amazing. Thank you. That's it. Do the work. I need to stop because I'm, I'm not. I'm doing all the work. I think, that's gonna, I think that's going to see me through, isn't it? What do you reckon? That's going to see me through for a bit, Leanne? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I've got a loft. Now, I don't have anywhere to put this, but that's not going to stop me turning down all this lovely cardboard. Leanne, you're a fucking legend and a hero. I'm guessing maybe I can put them under there somewhere. There's got to be a space somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, we can fit it under there. Yeah, so I'm not complaining, even though I'm complaining. I can't get into my desk, but just because I need to rearrange and rejig. I've got tons of it. Tons. Leanne, I'm very, very grateful. Thank you so much. You've been supportive of me from the very first beginning. Very first beginning from the very beginning. So I appreciate you. Massively, massively appreciate you. Right, let's have a look and see what we got today. I'll put it all in this bag, because why not? Oh, nice. Please be branded. Please be Gore-Tex. I've just found some freebies. Right, so you would have seen there was loads of games in there, loads of Nintendo Wii get. I can't actually go any lower than this. This is as low as I can go. I wonder if I can put this here today. Here, it makes a difference. That's better. 
There was loads of Nintendo Wii games in there, and I think I just got the cream, basically. There was a guy standing there. He took Wii Party, which is fine. He was there before me. £3 each, we've got Mario Kart. All the discs are minty. Mario Kart, Wii Sports Resorts. Don't really know if this one's worth anything or not, but I picked it up anyway. Donkey Kong Country, might be. I'm sure it's worth more than my free quid. And of course, Super Mario Bros. All discs are minty, £3 each. And then we picked up these Tupperware set. Tea, coffee, and what I think to be sugar, maybe. Because you sort of like push this in here, which I'm guessing makes a seal. Push that down, and then let go, and then it seals the lid nicely. So what would need, it would be sugar, wouldn't it? When air hits sugar, it, it chalks up, doesn't it? It like clogs up, it gets all bricky. But these are vintage Tupperware. I just think they're a really nice collection, a really nice set. Immediately I'm thinking at least 20 quid for the set, but there are some that will shock you with Tupperware and you'll be like 60 quid for that, for that set, 59.99, something like that. I don't know the true value just yet. Let me stick a screenshot up. Hopefully I've done some research by now. I would have done, of course I would have done. So a little bit of a, a little bit of this lid here is chipped out and gone. That's probably where they keep, you know, lifting off and off, off and off. Yeah, just off and off, off and on. It is what it is, isn't it? And then we've got the Euro Hike bag. This was 10 quid. I don't mind paying 10 quid for something like that. This is the Wilderness 65, so 65 litre trilogy. It's got all the straps, all the back supports, all the wrist, all the waist supports, all the crossover straps. And a lot of them go missing sometimes. In the bottom here, it has the rain mac. So you pull this out and you put it over the whole bag if it starts to rain to keep your stuff dry and the little freebie that i just pulled out was some little gators some gators now gators can sell really well as well you are better off if they're branded of course but even non-branded these look very burgalsy to me i need to find a label no i think they are just generic ones but probably six or seven back just on them the bag i don't actually know to be honest but what i do have is my phone Let's have a look. Can't find the exact model that sold. Oh, there we go. Thirty-five ninety-nine, and starting bid of twenty-five. None sold at the moment, but that doesn't mean they won't. Thirty-five ninety-nine. I'll list mine for twenty-nine ninety-nine and get it shot. I might keep it, actually. It's quite good. When I was in there, I was packing my stuff, and I said, "I might just. I don't, I don't mind that. You can fit loads in there, and strap it to your back." Yeah, boss. You know what I mean? Right, well, a couple of sales. The pink t-shirt yesterday that I said was going to get cancelled did get cancelled and then rebought immediately for the full price of £25, 25p. This is an Agnes B. Really, really nice. little soft thing. I'll put a screenshot up for you. Don't forget, paid £3 for that one. Bash. Have we got any more? Just one more to show you. The Batman towel has sold. Rick Barrows picked this one up, aka Dragon Saw. I think that's how you pronounce it anyway. Dragon Sour. Dragon Sour over on Vincent. I know Rick's name anyway, because his name's Rick and it's a great name. Rick, massively appreciate you, mate. You picked this up for 1966, because that was when the first episode of, I think it was the Adam West Batman, he said. I know it's a cheeky offer. It's the year the Adam West series came out, 1966. Great year for football as well. How are you getting on, England? So, £45 of the sales there. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Free free on Vinted. There's not many more, there's, there's no more sales to show you other than that because it's still, I think it's the back end of the same day from the last video you've seen, I think, or front end of the day. I'm not too sure, but those two rolled in, so I thought, might as well just show you them anyway. Just jumping in here because it's been about five minutes since I stopped filming and I listed those games and I've sold three of them already for £15. The only one I haven't listed is Mario Kart because I'm going to list that with a console. So I spent £12 in total, I've got £15, 15 back, and the game still, so... Quick time. I knew it was never going to be massive money, but I knew there was profit in there for my time. That bag is now almost free. Sweet. Once again, massive, massive, massive thank you to Leanne. I really appreciate that beautiful stuff, man. That cardboard will not, not, not go to waste. As mentioned, it's the next day. We're going to go through a couple of sales and then we're going to pick a winner for that gimbal. Fantastic bit of kit, especially for you brand new content creators. You're going to love it. £12.98, we have this signed Nottingham Forest football. I think it's from 96, no, 90, I don't know what that is now. What's it from? It's just from the 90s, 96 or 99. It's got punctures, and I've mentioned all that because I tried to pump it up. It needs a new bladder. You can actually change the bladder, it's quite easy, if you can be bothered. 
had this for ages now. I think I paid a pound from the car boot sale. So for £12.98, and there was a message with the order actually. Hey Ricky, I did try to offer 1314, a great date in Scottish history. I almost did a Scottish accent then, I remember. Don't do it, because you're offensive. But the Bay of Eber would not let me. This wee football is going to my nephew in Nottingham. I know for a fact he will love it. Burst or not. <laughs> Lol. Love your videos, and to be honest, your attitude too. It's awesome. The wife, Shiona, and I are watching from Falkirk. Good luck to you. All the very best. Nori. Shiona and Nori, I massively appreciate the pair of you. Big up the Scots. Freedom. Love you both. Thank you ever so much. I massively appreciate it. I'm sorry, getting cancelled. £12.99, we have sold the Russell and Bromley shoe trees. They're like velvet, soft. They're for like high heels and stuff, I guess. Maybe the little pointy toe ones. Uh, Russell and Bromley branded on the handles. I paid, you, you don't know more than me, £1.50 in the charity shop, I think. £1.50. £12.99. Over on to Vinted now. It's being very slow because I'm currently uploading another video in the background, so my internet is going, no! Thank you. For £5, we have sold the Army Training Top. This is an American Army long sleeve top. I don't know if you watch the channel or not, but this is sold to Ben, so I appreciate you regardless. And the reason why I say things like I don't know if you watch the channel or not is because when we have a little bit of dialect, you know, a bit of dialogue even, not dialect, um, I'm not too sure if you watch the channel or not, but there was no obviousness, but you never know. I paid pennies for that, nothing. £10, we have sold the Katmandu shirt. Picked this up alongside the Adidas top that I bought for £3, I think. Sold it for £10 all in. The chap who bought this actually said he's having issues with his bank. Can he reserve it? And obviously, he's, when you do that, you think, oh, here we go. Here we go. No, he paid. April again. I know it's you. I know it's you. Bless your heart. Thank you ever so much. You have picked up a nice little bundle, actually. Let's go through that, see if I can find it all. So the bundle comes to a grand total of £25 and a few pence. And you have picked up the hat that I bought yesterday for... £2, the Adidas one, that's sold. The Mutant Doll has sold. £12.30. I think these are the right prices, because obviously when you do bundles, you get a discount, so maybe not. But either way, the whole lot comes to £25. The Cats and Pickles, Chonks, Beanie. And you bought something else as well. Oh yeah, the South Park wind-up figures, Kenny and Cartman. So £25 and a few pence for that little bundle there. Lovely stuff. April, I massively appreciate it, my darling. Thank you ever so much. On their way to you today. Lovely stuff. April, I massively appreciate it, my darling. Thank you ever so much. On their way to you today. For £7.77, Kaylin and Andrea gave me these at the car boot sale. We have sold the Nintendo DS bundle. There's like a few little games in there. Learn Spanish. Nothing too drastic in there. There's seven items. I sold them for £7.77. So Kaylin and Andrea, massively appreciate you for your lovely gesture. And Shirley, I appreciate you for picking these up. She said, I've got these for myself to keep my brain ticking over. There are, there's like brain training, learn Spanish, and a few other different things in there. Really nice little bundle to be fair. Nothing of any major value, but hey, they were given to me. So Kaylin and Andrea and Shirley, I appreciate you all. And that leads us nicely into the Nintendo Wii stuff that I told you about yesterday. Picked it up, listed it, sold it within about 10 minutes. Made, so far, £3.5 profit plus the game that's left. I knew there wasn't going to be much value in it, so I paid £3 each. Do you know what I mean? That's like maximum end that I'm going to pay. Yeah, I could save them and go to CEX, but I don't mind that. It's just, it, it took no effort at all. I'm going to make about... So if I've made two or three quid already, with the, with the Mario Kart and a couple of wheels that I've got, I'll sell that for about 10 or 12. I'll make about 15 quid in no time at all. It's beautiful. These have gone to Ashley. She left me a message actually, and it says, me and my partner watch your channel on the regular and our resellers together ourselves. Thank you for accepting the offer. I said, you're most welcome. I've literally just finished video in this and put them up. You were so quick. Ashley said, I have notifications on and usually I'm too late to grab anything as they go so quickly. But luckily our baby has just gone down for a nap. So managed to get on as soon as I saw you uploaded. Quick time, moving on. Ashley, I massively appreciate that. Shout out to you and your partner. And they're actually on Vinted as Red Rogue. If you'd like to go check them out, they said they're resellers themselves. So let's go and plug the channel. Right, let's pick a winner for this gimbal. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Make sure it's not broken or anything, yeah? All right, it's all still in there. It's all fantastic. Let's roll. Right, so we copy the video link. We paste it into the chat. We click fetch. Anything is going to go on this one. I ask you to send loads of jokes in, don't respond, and we'll see what happens from there. 112 comments in total, and the winner is for the 3-axis M1 Mirac 1 gimbal. Boom!
boom. Lucy's Cup, who say all lewd? Did you hear about the cheese factory in France that exploded? It was brilliant. Brilliant? I don't know. Lucy, come on! Congratulations, Lucy. You actually win the gimbal. I think you'll love that as well. You're a big content creator. You know what you're doing. Lucy, congratulations, my darling. Reach out, reach out, reach out. I'm so excited for you. I love it when you win things. That's twice you've won stuff now. I can't hate on that. Lucy, congratulations, my darling. Massively appreciate it. Don't go anywhere, guys. Take a look at this video here. YouTube thinks you'll like it, and so do I. Bye. <laughs> you thought I was gone.